We know the Summer Olympics are going to be kicking off in a couple of weeks right here on Local 4. So we're helping you literally train like an Olympian right here in Metro Detroit. For Fitness Friday, I'm taking you back to the Barwis Method Training Center with locations in Plymouth and Canton where Olympic and pro athletes train, and you can too. He has trained over 600 Olympic and professional athletes in 42 different sports, so I think he knows what he's doing. Mike Bowers, once again, along with Peter Vander Kay, our Olympian from right here in the local area. But talk to us about deadlifts, because there's a version that I would do if I wanted to stay in shape, and then there's a version for an Olympian. Yeah, no question. I mean, the deadlift, when we're looking at the technique, we want our feet about shoulder width apart if we're doing a standard deadlift. We want the bar to roll back over about our second shoelace. Uh, in our position, the most important part is setting our back. We want our shoulders up. Our knees should be just about over top of our toes. When we come up, we want to make sure that we bring our head and our shoulders up first and push through our heels. We don't want to bring our butt up, putting all the stress on the low back. Okay. So you're going to push through the heels, bring your head and shoulders up first. Good. Nice flat back. She's coming down. She's maintaining a flat posture on her low and back. And what is this working? It's going to work a lot on the quads, the glutes, but most, most effectively on the quads and the hips. All right, so how does it make Pete a, a world-class Olympic athlete? Things change with Pete, because Pete has to come off the blocks, and he has to come off very explosively. So he's going to do what more what we call a power shrug. He's going to start in a downward position. It's part of an Olympic lift. And now when he comes up, he's going to extend onto his toes and thrust his hips like he's lunging off of the blocks at the start. All right, sounds good, Pete. Good job. Good